Hey guys, it's Kazla. We're back with some more uh, Lost Sphere. We are currently working our way uh, to find some allies to stop the Empire, uh, as they seem to be wanting to just wipe the, the world clean uh, to get rid of the nothingness that seems to be taking over the world. Seems kind of productive, but they really want to get rid of monsters no matter what, and that seems to be their plan. Uh, so, we're going to go through here and work our way to a uh, new town. And I did do a little bit of grinding off stream uh, to get some money. Uh, I actually ran into a Autumn Bob, which is one of the enemies that gives a ton of money. Let's see. No, no, no. There's our preempt. Not hit all three. No. Yeah. Ore mo ikuzo. Okay. Okay. She. They seem to be immune. Immune to her. Yarda. Boku mo tsuzuku yo. Wa kiken da. Okay, good to know. Those guys are immune to those arrows. Probably just because of the type of arrow she's using right now. Okay, what? What's that mean? There we go. See that treasure chest? So let's climb up. See if we can't find a way to get it. Oh, we gotta climb more. So there's gotta be a way down on the right. Down we go. Oh, Violet Sprit Knight, that'll save us some money. Okay, I'm definitely buying new arrows. When we get to town. Come on, move low, goblin. I mean, preventive encounters just make fights so much easier. Okay, let's see, that should be Diago. God, that's a beastly hammer for him. If I saw a reason to use him over freaking. Lumina. But Lumina is just a beast. And her abilities just help her go even stronger. That was side, are you kidding me? Oh, 
That is definitely interesting that we can uh, swatch out, swap out members in battle. I didn't realize we could do that. Alright, where's this cave gonna take us? Bob Rock. I don't know what Bob Rocks give us, but Bobs are usually really good, so... Should die rather simply. Okay, so we need to upgrade it for it to take over that. Actually, is anybody still using night coat? It's a little bit better except for magical defense. Training gear. Yep, that'll work. This is just these are normal enemies. In here. Yeah, Lumina is basically just a beefy Tifa. Okay, that's our way out if we want to return. This side is probably about the best I can ask for that. <laughs> also forgot to take her off. Okay, there we go. So I had to weave that line just a little bit. 
はこれぐらいにしておこうやれるはい旅の邪魔はしないでほしいんだけどな Dem momentum kills though Shira has a new slot Let's take a look Shira Nope But let's get her out of that suit that she was not supposed to be in in the first place. Where does this drop us off at? I'm afraid to go there. Just in case it drops us like way back behind. Okay, fish here. ここは戦うしかない。行くよ。やるな。はあ。上出来だ。ダンジョンズ do seem to be getting longer though。これで。勝ててよかったよ。Since I got zeros, これが我が一族の秘術だ。Yeah, zeros from that. その調子だ。はっ。勝ててよかったよ。Shortcut back. This is the first dungeon where it's a whole bunch of little rooms as opposed to just one big area. But sounds like we are about to get into a boss fight. Wait, someone's there. It's Commander Galdra. I've been waiting for you, Kanata. Are you guys. Are your guards lying in an ambush somewhere close by? You don't need to worry. I'm here alone. Even though it was just a short time, you people were under my command. I should settle things with you by myself. Settle? After helping the Twilighters escape, you engaged in sabotage against the Imperial Command of Solni. On Solni. I wonder why you committed such reckless offenses. But I suppose there's no point in even asking. Because we learned the truth. The truth about the inhumane war Gigante was waging. The truth about the terrible weapon you unleashed. Not only did you snuff out the lives of countless innocent people, but you erased the memories we needed to restore what was lost. It was a painful decision that Lord Zimrod was forced to make in order to return peace and order to this world. Even if you destroy all the monsters, that won't restore anything that's been lost. And the Empire's Terramite weapon wiped out everything. Now we don't have what we need to bring things back. I didn't come here to talk. In truth, I regret this, Kanata. Commander Galdra! Everyone's power! 
やれる無用な戦いは避けたいな覚悟してよね<笑>宝石にも影響あるから味方を考えないとねここは敵の力を削いでおくありがとう食らいつくせ動けるぞ癒しの旋律を奏でよやれる混沌を律する風やれるよこの程度覚悟してよね俺がやる僕の番だね撃ち抜けないものはない、うん、たっ、うん、私がやろう<笑>この矢から逃げられると思うな、うん、やれる加減はできんぞ聞かないよ<笑>愚かなことだ<笑>僕の番だね okay, <笑>いけるじゃあこの私がやられるとは立ち止まるわけにはいかないからね<笑> oh, not yet I'm not done yet. Truth lies in actions, not in empty words. What do you really want, Galtra? Enough! The Empire must defend peace and order. The Empire didn't create that weapon for peace. Only for cruel, vicious slaughter, Commander. The end result may seem cruel, yes, but it was a necessary measure. Now the threat of monsters is lessened, and people can live in peace. Necessary? Lives that could have been saved are now gone forever. That, that is what you call necessary? Commander Galdor, where is your conviction? My conviction? Well, I don't expect one, I don't expect you to understand. I'm a soldier of the Empire. That's what I am. But I do envy you and your moral certitude. Your swords are bright and they speak clearly. My own sword has become tarnished. I fear and it wavers. Commander. Go then. Follow your heart where it leads you. I'm no longer certain that I have the right to stop you. 
<laughs> I knew it, Galdra. You have given in to your weak heart and failed in your duty as a soldier. General Traitus, what are you doing here? Fool, you still don't understand? Lord Zimrod foresaw this long ago. He knew you would betray him. I don't believe you. Lord Zimrod entrusted me with everything. <laughs> In that case, look at this machine. It was given to me by Lord Zimrod for the sole purpose of killing every one of you. That's him? That's the one who made... Who massacred all the monsters in Salmi? That reminds me, I meant to thank you all. With all the battle experience Gears has gained, it is much closer to perfection now. Gears, huh? This is too cool. It pains my soul to look at him. Salmi screams in rage at this mockery. What do the whimpering tears of anarchists like you mean to me? And you could never hope to defeat Gears. I will take care of the traitor Galdor later. First, I will silence your mouths forever. Kill them, Gears! Huh? Dianto! Ah, whoa. Look out, Lumina. No. Ah. Commander Caldra. Ah, such a feeling. Truly satisfying. Go now, Gears. Drain every last drop of blood from their bodies these wretched traitors. What? Uh. What the? No. Oh. Lumina. I. I. What's happening? I knew it. It's Locke. You? Why have you stopped? Go! Destroy them all this minute! What? It's defective. No, no, no. Lord Zimrod wouldn't have given, given me a defective machine. Did the scientist make some kind of mistake? How? How did he know my name? No! Come back here, Gears! I can't afford to lose you yet. Understood. Eek. You've been granted a reprieve, it seems. But when we meet next, it will be for the last time. Lumina, Dianto, are you alright? Yeah, I'm alright. I can't believe I lost, but that thing was strong. My body wouldn't do what I wanted. Why did he suddenly stop attacking anyway? I don't know, but... Oh, that's right! Commander Galder tried to defend me and now... Forget Galdra. Never show mercy to an enemy who tried to kill you. But he withdrew in the end. Sure. We can't just let him die either. Kanata. Don't worry. Commander Galder will make it. First, let's get him someplace where we can bandage his wounds. What? Are you people crazy? He's an Imperial soldier. They desecrated sacred heat. They wiped out Solni. If we let him live... He'll just attack us again. Kanata, why? 
Why would you save the life of someone like that? Commander Galra isn't our enemy. I believe in him. And even if he was, I, could, I think he could help lead the Empire in the right direction. The world needs more people like him. Besides, if we just let him die like this, we'd be no different from the Empire. Shira, Dianto. You can't change Kanata's mind when he gets like this. You might as well know not know that now. If he ever attacks us again, I'll bury my arrow in his heart. He's heavy. I'll carry him. Dianto, not you too. Thank you, Dianto. As War Maiden, I just don't understand you. Do as you please. But Shira, in your heart of hearts, you get it, right? That's the reason you're helping Kanata, right? Now that that's settled, we should be moving on. That Gears thing could be back any minute. Okay, first things first, we're gonna go save after that. And now to press on. right there. Let's look this direction. There's a cave up there. Let's see what kind of artifact we have to build this area right here. Got bombs. Harvesting soul walk time waste. That could be useful. Paragon deal extra targets for some. Soundgate is tempting, but I'm going to take this time waste. Because that could be useful in boss fights. Especially against super fast bosses. Artifact already here? Hmm. It's broken. No, we can't go that way. Oh, but it's a zone, so we'll probably go there eventually. This is really confusing. I understand why there's basically like an artifact there, but there's still nothingness. Alright, well, let's go in here. We're lucky we found this village. We can rest here. We need to patch up Commander Galra right away.
What is it, Shara? It's too quiet. I can't even hear the sound of children. Hmm. You're right. Anyway, let's find an inn. wrong with this river? It has an odd color. Is it maybe some kind of algae or something? No, it's the wrong color for that. Besides, you only see algae in still ponds or lakes, not a river's occurrence. With the lack of sounds and color of the stream, I'd say there's something very strange going on here. town it seems okay, there's the M. but I saw a memory thing or no I saw a treasure chest seems to be sick. <coughs> Welcome. Are you alright? Is this an inn? A hospital? Well, it's supposed to be an inn, but lately it'd be hard to call it that. This village was struck by a strange illness, and now it's filled with sick people. If I were you, I could have moved on and quick. Thanks for the warning. But we'll make our own decisions. Cut it out, Van. Our friend is wounded. Can we stay here until he's stable enough to move? No problem. I'm happy for any new customers. You can use the bed in the back room. Thanks. Dianto, could you carry Commander Calder there? Sure. So we're probably going to have to solve the reason that the river's flowing purple. Like I said, something seriously wrong with this village. Yes, too many people are sick for, for any normal illness. It might be wise for us to not walk around too much. But we have things we still have to do. I'm worried about the Imperial Command coming after us. We need to make plans in case they find us. We need to scout around the village. Okay then, I'll keep watch over the commander. He's a vicious imperial dog. A girl like you shouldn't be here with, alone with him. But it's exactly his pride and honor as an imperial that will keep him from hurting a girl alone like me, don't you think? Fine, I'll leave it to you, Lumina. 
We'll be back soon. I'm gone. You pull a Diato. Okay, I anticipate we probably have to go up somewhere up here to activate a thing. Since we haven't scouted, technically we probably would have came in contact with that inn earlier. And I think I was right. Oh, a customer. Sorry, but we're not open for business right now. There's a terrible sickness going around the whole village. Well, you seem to be well enough, no? Fortunately, in my job, I mix a lot of mes medicines. One of them must have accidentally helped me resist the disease. Now for that, I'm sure I'd be just as sick as everybody else. What about the spirit cure? That doesn't help either? Oh, you know about our village's spirit cure. It's true that the spirit cure might help. If I could make some, that is. Spirit cure? It's a medicine made from special herbs that grow, only grow near a holy tree. And where can we find this holy tree? Deep in the holy cave. But lately, it's turned into a den of monsters, and no one can get anywhere near. So if you had the herbs that grow around the holy tree, you could make this spirit cure? Why well, yes, I could do it all right. But it would be suicide to go to that holy cave. You die from monster venom way quicker than you would from this fever. So, as anticipated, we have to go to that cave. That's classic JRPG trope. Though the area right next to the village is where you need to go. Make sure there's nobody else to talk to. That seems to be another one that we need to talk to. I don't know who you are, but stay well away from me. I don't want to get you sick. <laughs> are you alright? We're just travelers here. What's this illness going around? It's horrible. Get in your throat, your chest, hard to breathe. The whole village got it. We're just waiting to die. It's not too late for you. Hurry and leave here right away. But why don't you treat it? There should be some fine medic medicinal herbs here in this village. Oh, so you've heard about that, huh? But those times are long gone. We can't collect any more herbs here. Besides, this is some kind of punishment from heaven. And there ain't no way to cure it. Punishment from heaven? It's all my fault. I made a deal with the Empire. We take their harmless waste here into the village and we get paid handsomely for it. So happy at the time. Plenty of money for everybody. But in the end, this was our real payment. A disease stealing our lives and our beautiful natural environment turned to hell. What happened to the money? You could use it to hire doctors. We never got the money they promised. All they did was hand out some minimal rewards. We used to make our money selling herbs. 
then we couldn't collect them anymore. So all we had was the money, little as it was, from accepting the Empire's waste. As the waste kept coming in, more and more people got sick. So you're saying the Empire tricked you? I'm the village elder. The blame's on me. I should never listen to a man like that. A man like who? A man wearing strange clothes came to the village. I'd never seen him before. He said Gigante had hired him to find a large track of land. I was a fool and let him handle the deal entirely. I'll take the shame of trusting the fast-talking preening creep all the way to my grave. Strange clothes, a fast-talking preening creep? Could it be? You have some ideas, Shira? Now, go on and get out of here. I ain't gonna make it much longer. I'm telling you, the sickness is no joke. <laughs> you appear to be suffering indeed, and yet your mind is clear. Yes, it's all the fault of the Imperial Command. No, our village elder. <laughs> what do you mean? Thanks to the elder, our village agreed to accept waste from the Imperial Command. They even built a sewer line that runs all the way to here. Ever since then, people have been getting sick. Waste from the Imperial Command? The Imperial Command is developing terror type is developing terramite weapons and humanoid weapons. At a frenetic pace. They're probably pumping all the harmful substances left over from the process to the village here for disposal. Well, if it means the death of people who supported the Empire, I've got no sympathy. Sure. Weren't they just trying to survive? Anyways, we can't just stand by and let this become a village of the dead. If they really have to pay for what they did, they can make amends after we save them. You're too soft. A big environmental message here <laughs> about the handling of hazardous waste. Okay, that's the end. Some other houses we can go into. Can't go in there. Check after we get um, Lumina back. Let's see, I don't think we can go inside this house. So the only place we can really go is back to the inn. 
or to the cave. I don't think we're supposed to go to the cave yet. Don't come any closer. You might catch it. Are you sick too? <laughs> At first, I thought it was just the river water. But then everybody in the village started getting sick. Everyone's suffering with a high fever and terrible coughing. River water? Could that have something to do with the sickness? The source of the village's water is the holy cave. The water springs up from there. It's done so since ancient times. <laughs> the holy cave, huh? Can we not? You guys aren't triggering anything, right? Okay. Oh, I can't make any of this. Okay. Oh, I'm not going to bother to buy new stuff yet. Because I'd like to have Lumen in my party to do so. It's a little sad that our strongest member took off. Okay, it still wants us... These. Do I have to go back into the end now? It's the only place I haven't really done. seem to be what we needed to do. Hmm. There has to be something else to do in the town. Okay, game, what am I supposed to do? The children. Are there children in here? Talk to that lady. Do I not talk to all the children in here?
seriously, what am I missing? 